today's simulation would involve the Peparo mud volcano undergoing a heightened state of activity, not a substantive eruptive event. This particular type of, of event would require residents to be, to be vigilant and practice the evacuation procedure which is, is being done today. The Office of Disaster Preparedness, ODPM, in collaboration with the Trinidad and Tobago Police and Fire Services, the Red Cross, the Ministry of Rural Development and Local Government Disaster Management Unit, collaborated in a community evacuation drill with residents within the 300-meter hazard zone of the Piparo mud volcano. Regional coordinator at the ODPM, Navindra Passad, explained there are approximately 100 residents within the hazard zone, and the simulated exercise is important to ensure the preservation of life and limb. Back in 2019, the Peparo mud volcano uh, underwent a heightened state of ac activity. Um, thankfully, the volcano did not increase this activity to the point where a major eruptive event occurred. However, this brought into action several agencies in emergency management to come together to coordinate and have an, an effective uh, mechanism in place to respond for the event of uh, eruptive event occurring. In the long term, Mr. Passard said the ODPM is collaborating with the University of the West Indies to facilitate long-term research. The ODPM is collaborating with the Petroleum Studies Unit of the University of the West Indies to conduct a long-term research and study on the Peparo mud volcano and we hope to utilize the information that they analyzed to actually integrate it into our planning for emergency response. The simulation was held on Saturday morning. Ayana Carter, TTT News.